Well, howdy, and what is happening, y'all? My name is Lomo Scorpio. Top notch, still guys. My name is Lomo, and welcome back to my channel. My name is Brigid. I'm an autistic content creator who has been at this for the past five years, and I have played games of many, many different kinds throughout the years, and created fictional characters as well. I've been playing GTA 5 online for the past eight years, and I've been playing it since its very, very early beginning days, all the way back in 2013. I've also played Dead by Daylight, of where I played Rain Around the Rosie with all the killers throughout my time playing the game, and especially playing mind games with them and completely duping them out. I played Overwatch, where I sniped off lots and lots of heads as my Overwatch fiance, Widowmaker. From creating Sherry the Sherman tank on War Thunder to doing tricks and stuns with monster trucks in Monster Jam Steel Titans. From playing Destiny 2, where I have created Carlia Croft. To Sea of Thieves where I have created Michelle, the strongest pirate girl in the world. Along with having created the Scarlet Bandit in Red Dead Redemption 2 Online, I've also been part of the Outlaw Gunslingers for almost three years. Hi, subscribers! Oh, yeah! Yep! Smash that like button! Oh, yeah, shout it. out to my friend Keenan here! Hey! My name is Brigham YT, and... Definitely do not forget to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications, and welcome to the channel. Ten years ago, this car, the Nissan GTR R35, was debuted and released for production. Now becoming yet another of the most popular Japanese cars in the world, the GTR R35 still remains at the top as one of the most iconic Japanese cars of all time. The sounds of its big grumbling twin turbo V6 sends shivers down the spines of those that have heard it. Even though it's not exactly a skyline like it was back before the GTR came out, the GTR R35 continues to carry on the legacy of the famous Skyline R34, including Paul Walker's from Too Fast, Too Furious. But this car has been featured in one of the more recent Fast and Furious movies, which I believe was Fast 7, as far as I can remember. And that made the GTR... R35 even more famous when it was debuted and featured in one in one of the Fast and Furious movies. But now it is finally here. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you the 2020 Nissan GTR R35 Nismo. You guys have no idea how long I have waited to finally get my hands on this in Forza. Like, y'all legit have no idea how badly I've wanted this thing to come into the game. And now it is finally here, and I just got it today. After getting 20 points for... for this month's Spring forza -thon season, and now I can finally take a look at this thing in all its glory. A big ol' uh, 4.6 liter V6, I think. But, uh, I'm not too entirely sure. So this thing's packing 600 horsepower, 481 foot-pound of torque, and an overall weight of 3,867 pounds. Oh 
my god, the idol! Yo, the idol! Interior still looks the same, though. But guys, this is the part of it that I have been waiting for. Okay, so now let me uh, get on the road here. Because, let us listen to the sound of this monster. I knew it! I knew it! This thing sounds way different than than those other two GTRs. So here we go. <clears throat> this is exactly how I anticipated this thing to sound. This thing sounds exactly like it does in real life. Now, I'm sorry if I made those weird noises, guys. I'm just so happy to finally get my hands on this car. Oh my god, y'all have no idea how happy I am to finally have my hands on this car. I'm so fucking happy. I am so happy right now. But, I am going to now upgrade it to the way that it's going to be whenever I uh, am cruising around with people. But first, let me find a, a perfect livery for it. Uh, wait, 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 wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. A minute. Wait a minute. No. Don't tell me. You can... Oh my god. You can put a wide body on this? Are you serious? Are you actually serious? Are you actually serious? Are you serious? Oh my god. There is no way. Dude, what? Okay, I did not expect that. I didn't expect it to be possible to actually put a fucking wide body on the 2020 GTR. But turns out, you can. Okay, so mine has now been upgraded to 959 horsepower, 769 foot-pound of torque, <laughs> funny number, and now an overall weight of 3,338 pounds. Oh my god. If only y'all could see this, this enormous smile on my face, because I am so happy that this car is now finally in the game. Like, y'all have no idea how long I have waited to finally see the 2020 GTR R35 Nismo or whichever year uh, this car uh, uh, it is to come into the game. But now, I, I'm a happy fanboy. I'm a really, really, really happy fanboy. Truly, I am. <clears throat> oh my god, I'm so fucking happy that this thing's finally in the game. Oh my god, I'm so happy.
Although I wonder... God, the sound of this thing. Yo, this fucking sound. The sound of this thing. Oh my God, I fucking love it. I absolutely adore this thing now. This is now my new favorite version of the GTR. This is actually now my favorite GTR of all time. I absolutely fucking adore this thing. And this here is livery, which I'm not going for it. Because it really makes this thing pop. This thing, guys, is now my number two favorite car of all time. While well, my number one favorite is the 2011 Lamborghini Gallardo LP570-4 Superleggera. But this thing is now my number two favorite car of all time. God. Okay, I'm taking this to the highway. Because I just want to see what this thing can actually do. <clears throat> oh, listen to that growl! Oh my fucking god, this thing is amazing! I absolutely love the GTR. God, I fucking love the R35. I love this thing so much. The GTR R35. This year of the GTR, this 2020 GTR R35 Nismo, in my opinion, this is the best GTR R35 that has ever been released. And, well, just ever, uh, of all time, I mean. Like, I absolutely adore this thing. Like, oh my god. In 400 yards, turn sharp back. Two hundred and sixty-eight miles an hour in this thing. And here's the Moser. Just put that on as well. <clears throat> okay, now, in first person this time. And now, let us take this thing to the tunnels. Uh, of which we are going to the ones that are over here. 
just so that I just like so near the rumble and the roar of this thing. All right, guys, here we go. Okay, this was by far the best car that I have ever done a video on in Forza Horizon 5 so far. So this guy is going to wrap it up for the build and review of the 2020 Nissan GTR R35 Nismo. You guys will definitely be seeing me driving around in the game in this thing a lot. As well as my other cars, but this thing is definitely not one of my new favorites. Because, well, once again... Y'all have no idea how long I've waited for this thing to come into the game. So yeah, thank y'all so much for watching. I really do hope y'all enjoy this video. And I will see y'all next time. Peace out. <laughs>